Hello guys, this is Amos Doll Music and in today's lesson I'm going to teach you how to play the Phineas and Ferb the movie song called We're Back. Okay, so give you a preview before we start learning it, check it out. Alright, let's learn it right now, so let's go. We'll break it up to a few parts that's easier to learn. So the first part goes like this, right starts on the D up here, so middle C, go up an octave C, is a D right next there, okay? It goes D, C, A, C, D, C, C, A, G, A, G, F, F, D, F, G, F. That's it for the first part for the right hand. Let's do it again, so goes D, C, a C D C C A G A G F F D F G F. That's it for the first part for the right hand. Left hand we have two chords for the first part. The two chords are F major, which is F A C. Second chord is B flat major, which is B flat D F. So with these two chords in mind, so F major and B flat major, the two hands together goes like this. So right hand starts, C and F major together. G and F, B flat major together. That's it for the first part. Let's do it again. So it goes together. Together. There you go. That's the first part. Moving on to the second part. Right hand continues. Goes up to C, D, C. A, A, C, D, C, C, A, A, G, F, F, D, F, D, F, G, F. That's it for the second part for the right hand. Let's do it again. So it goes C, D, C. A, A, C, D, C, C, A, A, G, F, F, D, F, D, F, G, F. That's it for the right hand. Left hand, same two chords as the first part, so you know it's F major and B flat major. So with those two chords in mind, the two ends together goes like this. Right hand starts with the first two notes, and then the next C and F major together. G and B flat major together. That's it for the second part. Okay, let's do it again. So it goes together, together. That's it for the second part. So back to back, the two parts we've learned so far will be played like this. Alright, moving on to the third part, right hand continues, goes back up to the C, 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 A, C, C, D, E, C, 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 D, D, C, and then G sharp, A, G, F, 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 G, F. Okay, this is probably one of the harder parts because it's more continuous for the right hand and also the left hand has more chords as well. So let's do it again, so it goes C, 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 A, C, C, D, E, C, 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 D, D, C, G sharp A, G, F, 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 G, F. That's it for the right hand. Okay, so left hand we have four chords here. The four chords are F major, which is F, A, C. Second chord C major, C, E, G. Third chord is D minor, which is D, F, A. And fourth chord is B flat major, which is B flat, D, F. So all these four chords in mind, so F major, C major, D minor, and B flat major. Two hands together goes like this. So right hand starts with the first C, second C and F major together. D and C major together. D and D minor together. Next F and B flat major together. That's it for the third part. So you can see there's more chords and it's like also faster changing chords as well. So you've got to practice this part a few times. Probably the harder part out of all four parts of this lesson. But let's do it again. So it goes together. 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 That's it. Okay. Yeah, so back to back, the three parts I've learned so far will be played like this. Alright, moving on to the fourth and last part. Right hand continues, it goes A, 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 G, F, G. A, 
A-G-F-F. That's it for the last part, this fourth part. One more time, it goes A-A-A-A-G-F-G. A-G-F-F. That's it for the right hand. Left hand, three chords here, finishing off the three chords of F major, which is F A C, second chord C major, C E G, and finish with a third chord back to F major. So you know these three chords. Two hands together goes like this. So right hand starts with the first A, second A, and F major together. After G, C major by itself. Right hand continues. Last F and F major together. And there you go. One more time, it goes together. Yeah. Together. And there you go, back to back, all four parts of this lesson will be played like this. Beautiful. So once you get the melody and block chords all good, you can play it very consistently correct. Then you can start to add your own improvisations and decoration patterns to make it more interesting. Left hand for the chords, you can do like octave bass notes and arpeggio patterns. You can do rhythmic patterns. That kind of thing. And then the right hand, you can harmonize it based on the chords to make it thicker in texture. So you can do something like this. You can be like... Try again. So something like this. Let me see. Okay. Okay. When you add improvisations, you really got to worry about the rhythm as well because since your left hand is doing many things and then the right hand, sometimes the rhythm change. You have to like go uh, with the proper like uh, rhythm of the melody as well because the main thing is the melody. Okay. So yeah. Got to practice the melody and block chords a few times first before mastering your own version of it, okay? So let's try it one more time, so let me see. Yeah, we got it the final time. Okay, so there we go. So really master the melody and block chords first of the song because uh, the right hand's a lot of like kind of fast running melodies and you have to get the rhythm correct for that first before like adding extra stuff or else it doesn't sound right. And also the left hand near the second half of it, the third and fourth part, uh, the left hand chords are changing more quickly. So you really have to master those chords first before like adding your own like, improvisations and personal flair to it. But yeah, that's pretty much it. I hope you enjoyed this lesson. If you want to learn more cartoon themes, go ahead and search up your favorite cartoon theme to learn on my channel. Just search up the cartoon name followed by Amos Doll in the search bar and you'll find it to learn. But as for now, that's pretty much it for today's lesson. If you enjoyed this lesson, make sure to check out the rest of my channel because literally there are multiple thousands and thousands of these videos ranging from pop songs of all languages, meme songs, video game music, movie, anime, and cartoon theme songs, and many more songs of all sorts that I teach. So most likely you can find your favorite song to learn on my channel. Also check out my website, bestpianomethod.com, linked in the description below if you want to learn more piano from me. Learn from my piano courses on how to play by ER, improvise, read sheet music, how to play and sing, and many more courses at all types of levels, even for those who have never touched a piano before. As for now, enjoy your time around my channel and see you next time.